Alright, the Pullman Standard Trailer Hitch Operating Manual. Alright, um, let's back out of this to 75%. Alright, you got one, your kingpin look, uh, kingpin locking plate, two, the rotor, three, the rotors for the rotor support plate, four, the actuator lever, five, the lever cam, six, unlocking knockdown lever, the seven, the vertical strut, eight, the dynamic locking plunger, nine, upper diagonal strut, lower, ten, lower diagonal strut, eleven, stabilizer cushion, twelve, plunger rod, thirteen, lung, lock plunger, fourteen, lock plunger spring. Alright, the lock, right, the, the, this is the right picture. It shows the lock your jaw assemble the trailer kingpin, and the kingpin must be secured to the lock behind the jaws. Wrong. Um, trailer kingpin and lock the jaw assembly. Kingpin is not properly secured behind the jaws. Um, Alright, the lock indicators must be vertical alignment to indicate lock condition. This is correct. And the lock indicator indicators of vertical alignment. Hitch is not locked. This is wrong. Semi-automatic hitch overhead lo loading um, to the top of um, the right-hand corner. There's not locked. Then below there, this shows the lock position. Cars are visually inspected to see that the kingpin is securely engaged with the track with the kingpin lock indicator, which is located with the vertical um, rear vertical face to hitch with the plate of the lock position. Lock indicator seal rod should be flush with the rear vertical face of the hitch plate. Um, warning, do not relief the car. For them to transit into the trailer as a lock, kingpin locked in, indicated the D, lock, locks were rod in the flush, lock locked rocks is protruding, diagonal strut lock indicator E, locked in indicator down flush, and unlocked indicator protruding. Know the indicator D on the warning plate attached for the hitch wheels illustrate the position kingpin locked indicator. Alright, your trailer train, trailer train maintenance alert, subject in proper bridge plate applications on the TTX. TTAX cars. 48 inch bridge plate shown on the TTAX car with the hydraulic end of the car cushioning until the compressed event with the buff compelled with the standard gear car. Alright, and then on the below that shows the 48 inch bridge plate shown on the same TTAX hydraulic end with the cushion unit extending the normal position coupled to the same standard gear car. Notice all TTAX cars require 60 inch bridge plates, all the standard equipment to the car. 48 inch bridge plates installed in the TTAX car will drive between the cars with couplers extending into the normal position. Caution. Um, so you want a 60 inch plate on a TTAX car. Trailer Train Company Mechanical Department, August 2000, 1977. All right, your tra trailer train company maintenance met bulletin number um, BO31, date um, February 1st, 1975. Subject brakes and rigging adjustment. All trailer train standard level uh, level piggyback containers cars equipped with a three level direction of a 33 inch multiple wear wheel to truck lever ratio on these cars within such that up to the 21 inch of the slack generated and the foundation wriggling as a result of the brake shoe and wear under the condition of the wheel and the show wear, shoe wear the similar tendency to approaching condemning limits for one of the three above the three problems that can develop. One, the double glove is the end of the truck at the horizontal level that can um, foul the bolster and brake show and becomes inoperative of the truck. The foundation rigging crossover the level that can be fouled. Center still slots and the brake boom um, brakes become inoperative of the entire car. Three, the slack adjuster can run out of the takeoff of the capacity piston trouble that will extend lower braking effectiveness for the control rod ultimately being damaged. To avoid these brake ringing problems with the car's multiple wear, wear, wear wheels, trailers and train recommends the following procedure. A manual one hole truck bottom at the bottom of the adjust rod adjustment should be made within the truck for all the train tra trailer train Standard level of the cars within 33 inches multiple wear of the wheels whenever the wheels are changed on out and small diameter wheels are installed. Either the truck is or also required the clearance between the clubble club at the end of the horizontal level than bolster is two inches less than brakes applied one or less when the brakes are applied. So either the truck is required in C figure one, the clearance between the either the body with the crossover level of the brake cylinder over the center so the slot is four inches less than the brake applied at A end of the truck only. C figure two, the adjustment made with the special tools of the equipment, restore the slack adjuster, take up the capacity, will share the proper rigging and the angle for the good brake performance through the wear of the cycle, cycle of the wheels and brake shoes. Trailer tra Train Company Mechanical Services. All right, figure one shows A if the two inches less of the spread of the rod, rod on one hole, and then it shows the um, figure two with the towards the brake cylinder. 
Uh, Circular 44, Association of American Railroads, Operation Maintenance Department, Operating Transportation Division, American Railroad Building, 1920 L Street, no, um, New, Northwest Washington, D.C. 20036. Our main investment, the Vice President, Operation Maintenance Department, Officer of the Division, R.F. Dunlap, Cha Cha Chairman, I.C. Ethington, v. Vice Chairman, J.J. Robinson, Executive Director, Rules Governing and the Loading of the Block and the Bracing of the Freight, Enclosed Car for the Container for the Trailer on Flat Car, Container on Flat Car, Issued by the Association of American Railroads, Intermodular Steering. Of the and committee with the developing damaging prevention committee with approval of the general committee operating transportation division. All right, rules governing the loading, blocking, the racing of the freight, and the closed trainers, trailer for the container for the trailer on flat car and the container on flat car service for the section one. Introduction of these rules supersede the GIS no, number 3539, um, revised in 1965, to apply with both the trailers container regardless of the plan, u plan use. The rules are designed for the benefit of all the all the all the parties concerned by adhering to the rules, both landing and the equipment, will be protected by the absence of unforeseen and unusual, unusual circumstances. It must be understood that the trailers contain with the main move of the direction, reverse direction for all the portion of the journey during the journey. In journey, journey, normal transportation forces must operate in the unbraced loads, cause landing and is pressed against the rear doors. If there is any imperative, the trailers containers maintained in the rail surface to be provided loaded in strict compliance with the general rules. The rules so can cover loading and all the types of the kinds loading. Ill Illustration principle for the container with the publication appear with not to cover the specific shipment being contended with the trailer on flat car container on flat car movement. The original courier loss damage prevention representative must be contacted with the assistance or the instruction reference in instru instru illustration of transportation trailers pamphlets include both containers and trailers. Section 2, General Rules. Carriers for rule, rules regarding the safe loading protection equipment, the protecting and landing of the most feet here, but the first of the foremost trailer doors with not sign designed with the restraining, restraining longitudinal movement of the landing with the resulting damaged equipment the landing, and therefore absolutely necessary for the landing of the to be sure curve with the prevent the longitudinal movement. The trailers must be inspected prior to the being loaded to ensure the suitable condition of the carrier to load safely damage the free of the destination to the destination. Section 2, General Rules. Prior to loading and cleaning, preparing trailers with carefully swiping the floors necessary, um, removing all the nails and cleats and the strap of the protrusion that might cause damage to the landing landing of the wheel well, obviously unstable to move the trailers for as far as the safety with the handling and protection of loading and the equipment that are concerned must be loaded, not be loaded. La la loading, landing weights of the trailers must be evenly distributed, both crosswise, lengthwise, and the combined weight of the landing. And the trailer must be conformed with the federal, state, and local regulations for the transportation services used to origin and final destination. The landing must be placed in such a manner to prevent if from shifting either crosswise, lengthwise, to ensure the proper way of the distribution position for the trailer of the original designa designation, proper loading to the prevent damage of the landing of the equipment would require the pre planning with a study, study where there is no doubt, any, where there is any doubt that the file of the contact should be made with the origin of the carrier law damage prevention representative for the instruction. Where there are no air metal that shipping the shopping, the shipping the new commodity with advanced instruction assistance must always be obtained with the original carrier. Landing should be loaded with the block and brace with both, both crosswise, lengthwise, to minimize the voids, the areas protected for the built of the landing. Bracing and blocking must be such for the restraining of the loading and landing for the pushing of the doors and the wheels of the trailer. Suitable dividers and separators must be used between the adjacent tracks, different size containers and the nature of the landing, and it's such that the damage will result in an even contact with the well layers. The heavier item must be loaded with the bottom layers lighter than the items of the top layer. Loading of the blocking, the bracing, explosive, flammable, other dangerous commodities but must be in accordance with the Department of Transportation regulations as published with the RM, Grasnose Tariff, and any other le le legal Regulatory regulatory agency. The present hazardous material and mixed with the French freight shipments FAK must be uh, specifically made known to the carrier based on beyond being so identified with the type of the characters on all bill landings. All right, and that's page ninety-eight, and I'm. Um, Section 2, General Rule. The trains equipped with the interior bulkhead with the other devices must be in accordance with the instructions set forth for the trailer, particularly where the care should be taken with the server that's the prop of the lock in place but before the completion of the loading and unloading. Um, that is usually any of the type of the material handling equipment to unlock the raised floor and bulk with the bulk, bulk, bulk head doors of the prohibited lumber of the use of the blocking, the bracing must be even the sound material free to defect with which compare the strength of the inferior for the proper nailing. Adequate size of the number of the nails may be even the drive and straight with the no tail and toe nailing in the construction assembly with the lock of the bracing securing with the same of the Trailer to not nail the sidewall with the trailer. Strapping you with the load, securing must be sufficient strength and amount to be so applied to the whole load. 
would secure with the crosswise lengthwise move and the insecure the block and the bracing loading ship with the wheel fly and the advantage of the eve of the device built in the trailers such as the belt rail, belt rails tie downs landing anchor devices are available the windage can be used in securing strap them to the belt rails the rails will round an angle edge with the should be squared and landing it should be um in the to this area with a down similar contour of the accomplished through the construction of the bulkheads and gates section three general accepted loading me- methods the illustration contained in the section indicates some of the, um some though not all other methods that may be employed to conform to the general rules of section two Our weight distribution within the trailer. The trailers are designed for the uniform load distribution. The payload with the distribution equal with the rear tire of the fifth wheel with the transport and the load with the truck track truck, truck tractor. Truck tractor. Illustration number one: The crosswise wave should be equally distributed, load be loaded but not loaded on the one side. With the overload spring with the tires of the side placed with the load with the weight with the equal the rear tires, eliminating possible twists of the frame, overloading axle housing wearing bearing. Brace against lateral load movement. In illustration number two. All right, this is wrong. Right is skid adequate, the construction properly distributed weight, and also um, right illustration number three. Loading heavy concentrated loads are occupying full trailer area floor. Right, this shows floating in incompa- incomplete la- layer containers to the square end walls needed to keep the load to the load tight at the end of the side walls. So we'll remove the obstruction walls over the floor. Oh, you have the divider sheet between the different sides of the containers. Use bonded um, block method of unloading and uh, doorway protection must be applied with the restraint of the loading of the damaged door lading falling out of the during the transformation. When the doors are open, the destination when the nature of the loading of the type of the trailer determine the restraining method used in section four. Illustrated issue number four shows the loading of the fiber fiber boarded containers. All right, you can figure out fire fire boarded filters um, fillers down with a center line. Note the dimension of the filler should be sufficient with the main line alignment to protect the landing of the following and the uh, alternative method: two by twos, one by fours, one by fours by two by fours. Uh, j- um, alternative method: locating a junction adjacent pallets. Doorway pr- um, protection must be applied with the restraint damaging the door of landing of the lo- lo- falling out of the doors when the doors are open. And destination weight nature landing of the, of the type of the trailer. Determine the restraint method used in section four. Illustration number five shows the application of the cross bracing. All right, this shows steel scrapping where the doorway protection must be applied with the restraint load with the damaged door for loading and the falling out during the transit when the doors are open with the destination weight of the nature of the landing of the type of the trailer. Determine the res- restraining method used in section 4. Illustration number 6 of the application cross braking, bracing rows located along the center line. Our right, illustration number 7, palletized bag loading. If the pellet has hand loaded with the trailer in some type, uh, same type of the pattern, Fiber board L separated from the type of the wall through um, rough to apply with the wall uh, wall lining paper. Doorway protection must apply with the restraint loading of the damaged door. The falling out of the during the transit when doors are open. Destination weight of the nature and loading of the type of the doors will determine type of the trailer. Determine the restraint method used in section four. All right, this shows a illustration number eight. Recessing method of loading straight side drums. The drums are in located to provide with a two point contact between the two adjacent drums on either side of the wall. Doors projection must apply with the restraint load with the damaged door of loading the panel with during the transit. The doors open with the destination weight. The nature of loading is how the trailer determine the restraint used in section four. Alright, section 4, loading restraint methods. The illustration contained in section indicates that not all the applicable loading um, restraint methods that may be employed to conform with the rules of section 2, loading restraint, the device of the internal integral to be in trailer with the obtained with the commercially other will require the insulation or supplemental dunnage to ensure the safe the transportation for the commodities. Capacity load with the high density commodity with the flat roll, steel coil, steel, steel rods, pipe, the ingots, etc. Other work are require additional blocking and bracing supplemental trailer loads restraint components with the in order to maintain loading balance for the further protection equipment. During transit, most commodities packaged in the fiber board boxes, bags, pails, or drums require a rigid full face bulkheads, bulkheads, contact strongest areas of loading without preventing damage. For the nature of loading and unrestraining methods employed, but may require that they load be restrained at more than one load location. Many of the load restraints for methods illustrated with the A are closed color loading pamphlets in section number seven, though, with the open top rules of the pamphlet number six C. Of bureau explosive with applicable to loads and closed trailers. The type of the mount with the restraining devices, mount materials, and used in any given load must have the capability to safely restrain the, lo- the, the landing. All 
All right, zero away protection must apply, but the strength of the damage endured, lading of the falling out during the transit of the war, when the doors are open, the destination weight of the nature of the loading and the type of the turtle will determine the restraint. Using an offset pattern containing the press laminated bulkhead against the sidewalls, adhesive with high strength, um, sheer strength, the following manufacturing instructions, application of adhesive sealing bonds. Illustration number nine shows the uh, applied laminated bulkhead. Our right, illustration sends shows a self-adjusting load restraining bulkhead for the full face of the full height loads. Illustration number 11, the trail equipped with the belt rail for the cross member of the restraining loading of the various location and apply what drive they use between the cross member the fragile loading of the nose of the trailer, thus the spreading of the area of the contact cover over the full face loading of the plane, plane points. Illustration number 12 for the cross member loading ratings. Cross member loading range, 3,000 load pounds, single, double, 5,000 load pounds, double, 65,000 pounds, triple. As you can see, one, two, three boards on the side of it. Um, 1,800 load, single, 3,000 um, load, double, triple, 4,000 load, load concentrated center area, half trailer width of the cross member. Also, um, your load concentrated in the is one third of the trailer with each engine for the cross center. 4,000 pounds single, 7,000 pounds double, triple, 1,000, 9,000 pounds. Indication directional load application illustration number 12, typical load application for the cross members. Load restraining system. As you can see, illustration number 12, 13 load anchors. The anchors must be attached at least 18 to 24 inches back to the face of the load for the landing will be necessary the proper end of the gates of the trustee reaction strap the applications and employed to ensure the protection of the landing of the such gates may be found with the pamphlet number 14 on the unloading, uh, unloading publications. Important features to be watched in selecting blocking the bracing materials. Knots that interfere with the nailing should be cut off with the dotted line. Large large knots between members cut off with the shown to use the short piece for cleats. Never use lumber with a cross grain for the structural members. Small amount of the bark does not mean the lumber should be rejected. Illustration number 14. In illustration number 15, floor blocking shows backup cleats, trailer, side walls, so 2 by 4 side blocking, and do not tow no, to, do not tow no. Illustration number 16, method of securing blocking to the floor with the bolts, 2 by 4 block cleats, backup cleats, trailer floor, bolt, 4 by 4 floor inch block load, and uh, 2 by 4 float wood cleat by 1 quarter inch by 4 inch by 12 inch metal plate. Rear grades for the use of the trailers with the posts and door posts 1 by 6s, 2 by 6s, and 2 by 4s. Illustration number 17. All right, circular number 42F, the supersede circular number 42E with the Association of American Railroads, Operation Maintenance Department, Operating Transportation Division, American Railroad Building, 1920 L Street, North Washington, with D.C., um, 2003, 6, um, 6, G.E. Martin, Vice President, Operation Maintenance Department, Officers, W.T.F. Thompson, Chairman J.T. Colson, Vice Chairman of J.J. Robinson, Executive Director, Secretary General, lo Converting lo lo General Rules, general Covering Loading of the Car Loading, the Car Load Shipments for the Commodity with Enclosed Cars. To the member of the General Rules Code of the Circular Number 42E with the October 1975 had been revised and sh should be shown here. And these general rules must be observed with all the closed door loading with the take precedence over the loading method preferred to include the loading pamphlets listed on page 12. Pamphlets contain detailed methods of the loading specific commodities on the behalf of the General Committee, respectively, J.J. Robinson. Robinson, Executive Director and Secretary. General Wells closed cards for this bank is intentionally left blank. All right, general rule, rules, closed cars, general rule for the company and loading of the car, car load, shipment for the combining of the closed car. The following rules have formulated for the purpose of providing safe nets for the loading of the closed car. The must be observed. The primary purpose of the rules is safe transit, real car from origin, destination. Rule 1, the inspection selection for the car's cars must be inspected. The car for before placement of the load for the car must be inspected. The shipper with the loading points and see that they are in suitable condition to carry out the loading um, safely. Destination box card loading metal for the very concentrated weight. For example, the tin plate with the copper and lead lead in gas cathodes the slab spetters, all other high density components must be inspected originated with the carry either before they are placed in loading of the, uh, or loading point to see that they are in suitable condition safely loaded to the destination. When ordering box cars loading the concentrated wave, the heavy commodity shippers have the responsibility notifying sever severing a serving carrier for the purpose end of the not loading any of the cars um, not inspected per rule one B one. Um box cars selected for the loading metal to have heavy concentrated for example the tin plate, copper anodes, lead, ingots, cathodes, and slabs spelt less splatters.
In other head identity commodities must meet with one of the following requirements. Car stencil adjacent with the doors opening 25k to 50k with an indicator with the floor of loading capacity. Have wooden floor of, the, of two and a half quarter inch thickness with the sound condition support with at least three metal floor of the stringers on each side of the center sill of the full length of the car. If the equipped with the side floor, um, sliding sill for underframe that have the wooden floor with a two and a quarter inch thickness with the sound condition support with at least two metal floor stringers on each side of the center floor of the length of the car. If the equipped with the steel floor steel um, special type wooden floor with the full length of the car provided with the overall strength of the floor that's not less than four floor than three strings and specified on the foregoing in depth. Verification floor strength with the obtained with the mechanical department of the car owner. All such floors of shrub structure structure supporting structure must be in good condition when cars are loaded. Strapers have responsibility to attach and concentrated floor loading card. Figure one to the routing of the place board on each side of the box car which metal of the density of exceeds 400 pounds per foot cubic foot load of the epsin or 100 800 pounds per cubic foot bore for bearing. This, uh, this car contains a concentrated floor loading handling carefully. The car number inspecting carefully and station date number of the center weights of the load occupying less than the total floor space must be secured so that not permitted when accumulated effect of overloading on one inside of the one side of the car when loaded with the corner of the rule 4-1. Our right, general rules, closed car. Rule 2, the clearance of the side bearing of the load car for the, the car is not equipped with the constant contact side of the bearing for the zero clearance. Normally, there must be a clearance side that's the side bearing to permit the free curvature of the truck. Rule 3, maximum load weight. The weight of the load of the car must not exceed the lo load limit of the sensor on the car. The weight of the load of one truck must not exceed one half of the load of the limit of the sensor on the truck. On the car, rule four: distribution weight of the wheel line, weight of line length, line width, line lengthwise in the car. The full for all, for all box cars except for the Sager double double word box car, was built in 1966. For the percentage of central load with the limit is shown with the load the most may exceed, but the loads between the truck centers the measure of the length wise for the cars unless the car owner otherwise designates by note the official register of those percentages may be changed: 10 foot to 20 foot, 50 percent, 20 foot to 1 inch, 24 foot, 68 foot. 60%, 24 foot, 1 inch to the truck center, 75%, and truck centers to the full length with the car, 100% center line, 10 to 20 foot, 50, 21 foot, 1 inch, 24 inch, uh, 4 foot, 60 percent, 24 foot, 1 inch to the truck center, 75%. Truck standard full length of the car 100%. The full staggered door of the door box built in 1966 percentages listed in Rule 4A will be as shown in the table shown below. Inside car length 40 to 50 feet, um, 40%, 35, 40, 45%, 75%, 100%, 35%, 50 foot, 35%, 40 foot, and 75%, 1%. Length of the load 10 foot, to, um, 20 foot inches, 20 foot, 1 for 24 inches, 24 foot, 1 inch to the truck standard. Truck standard is the full length of the car. Fully for, for, um, for fur, further maximum loads, um, 40% stands up with the load limit. The precision rule A and B would be not applied with the wind. The material load in either end of the both ends of the truck centers and of the cars must not exceed 15% with the central load limited with the box cars bolt prior to the January 1st, 1966. 25% with the cars built in subsequent January 1st, 1966. From loading with the covered hop cars, compartments are to be um, unfamiliarly loaded and unequal hit unless the car is listed in the official railway equipment register that's being designed on unequal compartment with the loading. When loading a high density material gross railway loading and less of the 60% available the volume of the car owner may be contacted for approval. General rules closed cars. The covered hopper of the subject of the top over the unloading may have the compartments listed below with the partially completed unload. Um, two compartment com um, cars are not permitted. Three compartment cars both end with the compartments the center of the compartment. Four compartments the center and both end with the compartments consignee with the bus uh, consigner must inspect the car before releasing and ensure the remaining load with the easier equally distributed with the means of provision rule five. When length of the load is less than the distance between the truck center and load is not located in the center of the car but the car of the load weight may not ne be near the either the truck center shown below when 50% or less any between the truck center's low 60% one sixth of the distance between the truck center's weight of 66.6 .6 of one fourth of the distance between the truck center is and 75% one third of the distance between the truck centers reduced to 87% three um, sevenths of the distance between the truck center and two 90% one nine twentieth the distance between the truck center when crosswise the bearing pieces or you the distance between the outside bearing piece of the center of the center must exceed the minimum distance specified in the rules A and B with the percent of the sensible limited load limited being limited in sufficient number to ensure the, the uniform distribution and lining of the club cab four. Bearing pieces bearing pieces lengthwise of the car and steam with the end of the loading uh, load landing with the of the baby youth in order to spread weight distribution over the greater area in such area of the length of the bearing piece with the substitute with the length of the load and above the rules A and B with the bearing pieces uh, must be definitely in suitable strength with the relation to the percent of the state continuous sufficient 
number to ensure uniform distribution of length of the car floor. No, no likewise, uh, shifting landing of the permits wall unless loaded with the secure floating until the, uh, under the following conditions. All recommended security doorway protection methods are observed. Retardation aids are used for the floating of the load, lo loads in the closed car with the specified individual loading pamphlets to prevent excessive shifting on the car floor. Rule 5. Distribution away of the cross car of the uh, cross wave of the car load must be located with the weight along the both sides of the cards above out equal to the entire length of the load when the load is such of the character that can not be placed within an unobtained equal distribution of weight of the cross car swive of the car suitable plow is properly secured but the must be equal size of the weight then the box car landing must be secured to prevent tipping of moving towards the car side with the vacant space that across the car exceeds the following a total of 18 inches between the landing of the landing of the car slides the vacant cross, cross car, um, car space with less than 18 inches must be specified with the pamphlet's covering method the loading of the bracket bracing and barrel and card shipments of a loaded individual commodity with the box equipped with the adjustable suit I had wall fill out fillers diagonal opposite of the guy with the car for filling of the void of the um, space for the cross rise may be not be used the space providing space if it does not exceed 15 inches that lateral void space may be taken up using adjustables while all fill out fillers Box equipped with the full side wall fillers of the full side of the box and with the, with the car the front of the filling the void of the space for the cross car but the must be provided in such a space that does not exceed six inches with each side of the car lateral void of the space must be taken with the adjustable side wall fillers. Partial unloading cover hopper card for the cross wave of the car with the completing unloading any compartment along one side of the cars on longitudinal parts and sheets is prohibited. All right. Um, closed cars. Rule six: Loading in the blocking and bracing of the box for the cars. A. The must be load, um, loaded so that the secure but the permitted to unload for either side of the rail car, except at the size of the dimension of the individual using the pro freight prohibited. All lumber used for the blocking and the bracing must be sound material free to defect from the impairs of the strength of the interfere with the proper nailing. Many machines with other items of magnetically the high center with the gravity narrow base must be secured to prevent them from tipping over the transit when the car floor is not satisfactory with the material handling equipment and loading with unloading of the operation. Suitable steel plates and other adequate materials must be placed in the car. Floor facilities used with equipment to prevent the equipment from breaking in the floor. High tension band wearing secure with the load of the machine tension eyes the seal with the twisted tie of the respective the metal protector with the each with the such corners of the guard plate sufficient to provide suitable radius must be used to protect bands wires all points with the landing heading at loading landing having sharp edges applied so the prevent and displacement. The manner of the attaching metal tie to the car walls must be a corners for the meth prescribed for the individual command is replaced with the minimum of the possibility anchor plates possible pulling looser metal tier and tie ties shearing the thread the rods of the Bolt using and blocking the bracing connection there with the bus feet chisel with the immediately behind single and double uh, double single and double nuts to ensure the remaining of the original position two or more threads must extend beyond the nut the not required for the nuts lock or lock nuts used properly see if the lurking line fixture recommended a minimum foot point pound torque value note lock washers are not acceptable suitable su su substitutes high tension bands with high tension wires are specified with the detailed rulers they may be as substitute as sub substitute with each other with the equal load of the strength provided with all other items to be secured with the load, the equal number of strength, the otherwise specified the length of loading pamphlet with the number of the band with the wire with the rigid brace load that must have the combined strength joint strength with each of the longitudinal impact direction, equal way of the landing of the being secured with the proper combination of steel bands with the wire sealed with the sealing tools must be used to provide minimal joint strength with the size below listed below. Wire thicknesses one quarter inches by thirty one, thirty five, forty four, fifty, and two but um are minimum joint strengths for listed thirty four hundred pounds and fifty one hundred pounds. Minimum number of notches two and four and uncoated dryness three and four and coated uh, wax four wax four um recommended pairs of the crimp joints. Um two by two by zero forty four and two by zero fifty um eight oh seven eight hundred and seventy five minimum joint strength pounds four nominal notches uncoated m dry mix not coated not wax and wax four point four um four surface joints. Number of sufficient number of shields must be applied to accommodate the recommended number of the pairs, the number of the uh, notches for the crimps, over the recommendation minimum of the number of the notches crimps are based on the current general recommendation um, of the tie tension brand in the manufacture of the base tensing sealing tools being proper operation condition unless the number of the notches crimps are must be used the proper shipping to demonstrate the joint has the minimum strength shown on the table under the column minimum stro joint strength pounds. General rules, closed cars. In all ca cases, in all cases, sufficient number of the notches and crimps must be used to achieve the minimum joint strength of the pounds and should have the minimum joint strength pound. The use of the tension sealing equipment should be properly introduced. Instructions correct use of the tools and tools should be checked periodically to ensure their efficiency. Following illustration of the crimp of the notches type of the seal joint, the crimp type joint of the three pair shown and notch type joint of the two pair shown. 
High tension bands of one and one quarter inch and two inches U load, load experiments are made to are marked to indicate the manufacturer supplier's name of the letters AAR. Marking shall consist of the AAR manufacturer distributed name of the abbreviated name of the registered company trade symbol of the AAR code and is, and is consisting of two digits. Marking shell in character is not less than one eighth of an inch high as inside steel die imprint is not less than one quarter inch high and paint insurance ink surface of paint and then bossing in space and not the more than five foot intervals. The following method of marking and using identification have been assigned by the manufacturer suppliers. We will process and test by the AR finally to meet the requirements of the rule. Um, Acme Steel, AR 24, 20, 22, and then it goes on. The list goes on. It says high tension bands must be applied to packages loading of the marking facing outward. All right, general rules, close cards, high tension wire, eight gauge, eight sixteen point two twenty. Point sixteen twenty seventeen hundred ten point three eight and to gauge ten thirteen fifty um diameter third um thirteen fifty minimum maximum strength seventeen hundred eleven and a half gauge eleven thirty eleven hundred fifty minimum strength pound twelve. 10, 10, 55, 10, 80. Um, the following are to mention breaking strength of the common annealed wires and rods and bolts. Common annealed gauge 3, 2,500, um, 2,500, 2,200 pounds, 7.8, 18, 75, 1,100, 8, 17, 19, 95, 1150, 9, 15, 16, 11, 12, 50, 500, Seven eight sixteen thousand two hundred one twenty one thousand one hundred one one eighth twenty five thousand eight hundred one and one quarter thirty two thousand eight hundred one three eighth thirty eight thousand six hundred one and one half forty six thousand nine hundred at the root of the thread. All right, rule. F- 7. Doorway protection. When the possible loading of the falling of the rolling out of the doorway is component with the contact with the sliding side of the door, opening of the protective the ward door protection, steel strap without the material sufficient with the strength of the adequate sort, secure plug type door that do not normally require door protection, except with the cylindrical type of the such rolls and paper drums and see applicable money and pamphlets. All right, general rules and closed cars. Um, rule 8, can center of the gravity. The combined center of the gravity of the rail car can not exceed 98 inches above the top of the rail and close the car with non-particular po- possibility of exceeding with the center of the gravity the limitation of the of the cars in which they exceed the plate C dimensions. Car exceeding the plate C dimensions may extend 70 feet, uh, 17 feet above the top of the rail. Certain lanes, such roll with the way of the loading of the two layers of the high may result in success the combined center of the gravity dimension. Meaning the load limitation of the car exceeding plate C dimensions should be handled with the mechanical department of the origin center. Career carrier. Rule 9. Special equipment load protection device. Special equipment of the cars must be with the corner for the carrier and structure of the chaos member. The other equipment is restrained. The device must be left within the car with empty properly. You can secure with the rule 10. Opening and closing for the door. Mechanical truck for the forklift. The structure must not be used with the open the co- freight car doors unless the doors are equipped with a special door opening and closing devices. And general rules close car left blank intentionally. And then it probably goes on to something else. Left closed on the left and intentionally blank. List of loading pamphlets, closed cars, um, forward freight, wheeled vehicles, bars, commodities, barrel, drugs, plywood, um, all right, expert general rules governing loading combined with the open top cars. We're going to cut the tape.